Today is uh, not just another day in the calendar of India's space journey. Today is the day when a dream takes place in the form of this magnificent facility standing before us. I had heard about the Infinity Campus, but till I walked in, I didn't, couldn't have imagined the vastness of this campus and the, and the orbital class launch vehicle it houses, the Vikram One. We must thank for this none other than our Honorable Prime Minister for envisioning the potential of the space sector in the hands of the industry and young startups, which led to the space reforms, which led to the day we are witnessing here today. Today, I would like to compliment the Skyroot team, especially Pavan and Bharat, for leading the way and for those who have funded them for infrastructure that they've created in MaxQ, and in Infinity Campus, and I think they're also doing something in the Space City. I was wondering why this campus is called Infinity. It dawned upon me because the possibilities are quite literally infinite. More than the hardware, more than the technology, this campus represents something deeper. It represents belief. Belief in the capacity of Indian youth, belief in the power of Indian innovation, and belief in the possibility of an India that does not just participate in the global space economy, but would soon lead it. The Vikram One rocket that stands in this facility is not merely a launch vehicle. It is a statement. A statement that says, that says young India can design, build, and operate orbit-class rocket entirely with the right capital, talent, and ambition while standing on the strong shoulders of ISRO's decades of pioneering work and with the enabling hand of government reforms. I once again congratulate the Skyroot team and conclude with the resolve to build a stronger ecosystem in the space sector together. Thank you very much.